Hey, it's me Ellie from Xexpress Themes and today in this video tutorial of Xexpress Store I'm going to show you how you can uh, have your featured products or latest product in your home page like in our demo site as you can see here well this is the tutorial in which I will show you how to make your website's homepage look like same in a, as our demo site where I'm going to include these three sections So let me show you how you can show these products on your home page. So for that, log into your WordPress. Then you need to go to Appearance and go to Widget as these sections are going to be configured from Widgets. Here we have provided number of widgets and uh, in this side, these are the widget areas where you have to put those widgets. So in this uh, tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can configure these three widget areas, uh, sorry, these three widget areas, that is product listing widget 1, promo widget 2, and product listing widget 2. So product listing widget 1, what we have to do is, we have to drag a widget from here and put it there, that is this widget, that is AP. WooCommerce product slide. You can get a small description here too if you get confused. Just click it and drop it there. Now you have to do is put a title that in which title you want them to show. Then you need to choose the type of product type that is category. You want to show the category which you select or you want to show latest product up sell product, feature product or on sale product. I'm going to select category for now. Then here you need to select a product category which you need to make by going to here, going to product and going to category so which we're going to do in a while. And from here you need to select the number of product to show. Then save it and let's go to make uh, product category and add products there so you need to go to products go to categories from here you can add a new category like any new category and then click on add new product category After, the, after that, it will show here in the name of category and by going here, you can add your uh, products there. But I have already created a category that is latest trends where I already have three products. I'm going to show you how you can add your new products there. Now click on add product. Put the product name. Then put a small description. Well, I have it here. This is my dummy description. You can put your own description later. And you can select your product type and then put a regular price. Okay, maybe it's just a hypothetical price that I'm putting. Then a sales price if you want. If you are giving it on sale and do some necessary configuration, you'll get used to it when you start doing this. Then you need to set a product image. I'm going to get it from my media library since I have already uploaded. Then set it as a product image. Well, the best size for this product image is 503 by 503 pixel. But uh, you can use um, other image size too. But make sure all your product image size is similar. Then the next thing that you can do is you can also add product gallery image which is uh, when a customer in your website click to this image and go to a detailed page then they will see a number of related images there. So you can do it by going here but let's keep it like this. And then after this you need to select the category that you have created. Well this is the category I have sh shown you as an example but this is the actual category. So I'm going to select it here and publish. After your uh, category is created, your products are added there. The next thing that you can you need to do is go to your widget and select the category that you created to show on your home page. Let me refresh it first. 
all right now go to product listing widget 1 open the widget and select the category and you can select the number of product to show for or how many and click on save now after it is saved let's go to our front end and see how will that appear this is our front end and as you can see our products are showing in the way like in our demo site so the next thing that you can see in our demo site is this area so I'm going to show you how to configure this same thing go to appearance and go to widget let me close this one then this is the area where you need to configure to have that section that is promo widget 2 you need to use promo full width widget you can click drag and drop there or you can simply click there and choose the widget area that is uh, promo widget 2 and click on add widget after this you need to put a title you need to upload an image the best uh, image size for this is 1170 by 234 pixel I'm gonna select it you can select the style put a subtitle then put a small description here let me get a small description from my dummy content put it there now you'll get a button there so you need to put a button text you can put a link if you want to which when uh, the button is clicked will take you to that link and click on save now after it is saved let's again go to our front end and see how will that show you can see the second section that we configured with the title and sub description and a button which will take you to a link that you provided at your backend so now the next section is this one it is also pretty much similar to this section but let me show you how you can do that let's go back to widget that is uh, this is the widget area which controls that section that is product listing widget 2 the process is similar as in product listing widget 1 that is you need to uh, drag this AP WooCommerce product slide widget put it there you need to put a title select the product type and select the category well I have already created a category for this so I'm going to select that select the number of posts you want there and click on save now let's refresh our front end you can see here it is showing there is only three posts that's why these three pictures are showing So in this way you can configure these three sections and if you have any confusion regarding this video then uh, always uh, refer to our online documentation. It has got the full picture wise description which will be much easier for you and or if uh, there are any technical problems then you can write to me down below and I'll try to reply to you as soon as possible. Thank you very much.